Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I have a couple new hats that I want to show you. Mostly they're going to be Stetson, but we do have one rest of stole hat that we got in this week. So let's get to it. So the first one is called the Haywood. This is a Stetson hat, 10X, has a beautiful cattleman crown, also has eyelets on the crown, and it has a leather sword band. Pretty nice looking hat. Let's see if I can put it on to show you guys. How does it look? How does it look? So this one has a four inch brim and the four three eighth crown. Now the second hat is the Hagger Man. Nice looking straw hat. Cattleman crown eyelets, a black leather hat band, and the black sweatband. This one is a 10X. Colors 81 natural. But yeah, man, this is a nice, good looking hat. This is how the inside looks. Now let's see if we can put it on. So the brim on this one is a four inches, and the crown is a 438. Look at it. Pretty nice looking hat. Has somewhat of a squared front brim profile. I like this one. Now the third hat I'm gonna show you is the Stanhope 10X from Stetson. This one has a squared front profile brim. Cattleman crown. This one also has vented eyelets. A nice leather hat band with some detail in it. And this one has a dry leg sweatband. You know, dry legs is pretty popular with the crushable hats, but also the straw hats. So not all of them have the dry legs. I would say it's around 20, 30% of all the straw hats have the dry leg sweatband. Yeah, but this is a pretty nice looking hat. It's a 10X. This one does have a wide brim front profile. It's pretty nice. Now the crown is a 418. And the brim is a 414. That's how the inside looks. Pretty nice, pretty beautiful. Now, this is the fourth hat. This is a pretty popular hat. It's a pretty nice looking hat. Now, the thing that's different about this hat is the ventilated design compared to the other ones I previously showed you. This one does have a leather sweatband, a leather hat band also, and the brim is a 414 and the crown is a 418. The profile on this brim is more narrow than the other ones I previously showed you also. This is a 738, it does fit me well. This one is called the Range T by Resistol. And it's one of the George Strait Collection hats. This is how the inside looks. It has a leather hat band and a leather sweatband. Pretty nice hat. This one is a 414 brim and a 418 crown. Those look nice. So the last one I want to show you is the Fairmont by Stetson. This one looks pretty unique. Um, coming from the color, this one is called silver belly and the other ones I previously showed you are natural color so this one does have a gust crown it does look pretty nice this one does have a leather sweatband that 
It's a lot thicker than most, but you can always change it out, you know. If you have a collection of leather headbands, you can always, you know, swap it out. And this one has a dry leg sweatband. This is how it looks on the inside. Here's the front. This one does run kind of small. This is 738, which is usually my size. But when I try to put it on, it doesn't sit. We're not sure why. The whole the whole shipment of this ran pretty small. I'm not sure why. Maybe that's the style. It doesn't even have a tag where it says long oval or round oval on inside. So I'm not sure why. So keep in mind if you want to get this hat, maybe order a size up from your usual size. Maybe two. But yeah, this is this is what you guys get when it doesn't fit. So let me see if I can turn around and show you guys how the hat looks. I can see myself but yeah so I just showed you six hats for this season uh, these are all pretty good sellers especially the Williston so the Williston comes out number one on top the second one would be the would be the Hagger man it's a pretty nice looking hat also so this one would be the number one, the top one, 8X Williston. And then the second one would be the 10X Hagerman. Both by Stetson. It's pretty nice looking hats. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, the price range for these hats they start around 129, 139, all the way to 149. Um, I do know that the Haywood is in the Stetson site, but it's out of stock. The price range for that one is 150 at the moment. But if you go to other sellers, go to Google, go to probably Amazon, eBay, um, they have it a lot cheaper. Maybe $20 cheaper at 139, 129. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you.